What's up, my Moon Tribe? I'm Haley, and welcome back to Moon Tribe Tarot. This is for... <laughs> okay, so I'm going to have to get into the habit of not doing that. I have made an update on my channel, and I would like for you to go watch that really quick. But I, for every video, I guess I'm going to briefly explain why I'm changing things up. I um, wanted to change the style of how I read. I, I made an explanation video on how on, and as to why. And I would like for you to go check that out before you read these, so you know what I'm doing. But I'm not going to be stating the star sign until after the reading. So, this is a general message only, which means take what resonates, leave behind what does not. If you would like to book a personal reading with me where your messages will 100% correlate with you, you can find the information in the description box down below on how to reach me. Let's get right off into it. In the basis, we have the Five of Wands. The Five of Wands as the basis represents that there is some sort of situation that somebody needs to be sports-like, men, sportsmanlike, sportsmanlike, yeah, that's the word, sportsmanlike. Um, they need to, it's kind of a card of, it could be a card of quarrels and arguing at work, but that's not really what this card means in this deck. It more so represents that everybody is coming together to give it their all. They're vying for a position, be in somebody's life or a job, but this person is in a competition and they are trying to get something. They're trying to hone in their skills against, but not really against, but with other people. And they're kind of all giving it their best. The basis, sorry, the desires is justice so this is a legal legal this is a legal card it could be the sign of libra but it does denote to something that is um karmically legal karma it's like the judgment card if it was legal this is that um good things will come to you if you act in according to the law so if you pay your taxes you don't go to jail for tax fraud etc um that's this kind of card i have this in the desires it means that you wish for things to have a fair outcome it could be an illegality matter um, it, for some of you, it might be a legality matter, but for some of you, I feel like this is just, oh, for some of you, it might be a legality matter, but for, for the rest of you, I feel like this just might be a matter in which you want things to be more balanced because you feel like they might not be balanced. You are, what is going for you is the motherfucking Nine of Cups, and holy shit, can I say this is good energy or what? This is one of my favorite cards in the deck, um, and it's kind of made so a little bit more favorite because it's not just a wish fulfillment, it is something that you have to put the work into. It's not, you don't just sit there and wish on a shooting star and it makes everything better. This is a situation in which you are putting your hard work into something, and it's like a dream come true that it happens because you put the work in. What is going against you? is that there might be some delays along the way. There, the world represents a successful completion of a chapter and an ending. It represents the fruition of something, uh, literally closing out books and opening new ones. But having this here would mean that there is delays. So even though I do see wish fulfillment coming in, there is going to be delays until that happens in the month of February. Expect delays first, but also expect that it is going to come out to fruition because whatever it is, this situation, it could be a romantic relationship, it could be a legal matter. This is any new wellspring of emotion. It gives you a feeling of abundance and joy. Is somebody coming back and offering healing? It is somebody coming in and offering a new start. It could be a new relationship relationship um, but this is new love aces of cups are always new love and it is to take the gift of love to accept it um, so honestly here this all looks pretty good the only thing I want to say is that there might be some delays on your way to progress in the month of February for the star sign of Taurus what the fuck is up gang gang I'm the first video when I got the first goddamn card all right that's a little weird and I knew it I knew it Oh my god! Okay, so I'm having a fucking... Ooh, okay, that's weird, because if you watch the video, go watch the video of, as to why I did that, and you'll see that this is a little weird. This is the very first video I did in this fashion, and I knew it was going to be me once I saw some of the certain cards. Like, this is for the star sign of Taurus. Um, this is a really good reading. Um, <laughs> there is going to be major wish fulfillment for you, Taurus. There is going to be some sort of... Uh, there might be, expect some delays along the way, but there is going to be, um, <laughs> there is going to be some sort of wish fulfillment that will start, um, it'll probably end with a new wellspring of love. Until then, peace out, I will see you next time, my Moon Tribe. Have a good one.